Dr. Stacy Cannon says roughly 6 million pets are taken in by animal shelters every year. But there's a good chance that some of the stray animals you see on the street are the offspring of unsterilized dogs and cats. Spay and neuter surgeries are procedures for female and male pets that result in permanent sterilization. At Oconee County Animal Services, Kevin Hurst says the procedures are the solution to long-standing pet overpopulation issues. And if everybody spayed neuter, less stray animals running around. Spays, which remove the ovaries of female pets, are more invasive than neuter procedures, but only take around half an hour to complete. Neuters for male pets take even less time. Easy. We're talking about dogs, maybe 10 minutes, maybe 10 minutes. Uh, cats, we're talking about maybe five minutes. Dr. Cannon says the recovery time from these surgeries is generally around 10 days. Hearst's Animal Shelter on Branch Road in Bishop, Georgia, outsources these procedures to other providers of veterinary services, but a lack of awareness is an obstacle for the shelter's goals. We do a TNR, uh, you, you'll see some barn cats, stuff like that, um, as trap, neuter, and return uh, when we can. But again, as barn cats, far as the spay and neuter, if everybody would be conscious of it, and you have less stray animals walking around. Dr. Cannon says that the COVID-19 pandemic showed that the biggest obstacle for spay and neuter initiatives is access. At the start of the pandemic, these procedures were halted due to being non-essential services. And I think we're now seeing the results of that because we're starting to see more puppies and kittens um, that are coming from these animals that were not sterilized. Four years later, many pet owners are still unable to access spay and neuter. So it kind of just all comes back to the limitation is really access. American pet owners generally support spay and neuter initiatives. 74% of respondents said that spaying or neutering is the right thing to do. And 81% of respondents said that the procedures are important to control pet overpopulation. However, 33% of respondents thought that these surgeries can be dangerous to pets. And 17% of respondents felt that they are cruel. Georgia law currently requires animal shelters to sterilize animals before giving them up for adoption. For Grady News Source, I'm Jack Shields.